FBI's Kayla James is live and Kayla, you just learned this evening that one critical group of workers is not included in phase 1B. That's right, Steve. The next tier, which does not yet have a beginning date, makes food, agriculture, distribution, and manufacturing workers eligible. But today we learned that food category does not include grocery store employees. Healthcare providers, first responders, teachers, all are professionals currently eligible to receive the vaccine in Iowa. There are also people Mulholland grocery store owner Tom Mulholland believes are deserving because of how much they work with the public, like grocery store employees. There aren't many more that see many more customers per day than what we do. Mulholland says the 12 employees at his local grocery store in Malvern, Iowa, come in contact with hundreds of customers each day. He knows other grocery stores are much larger, which is why Mulholland is perplexed, wondering why grocery store employees aren't listed on phase 1B of Iowa's vaccination plan. Illinois and Nebraska are following the CDC guidelines that put grocery store workers in section 1B. This is the CDC's vaccine recommendation for phase 1B, which does include grocery store workers. There are other categories on this list also included on Iowa's phase 1B vaccination plan. The Iowa Department of Public Health tells us grocery store employees are not included in phase 1B of their plan. They sent this statement noting the vaccine supply is short in the state and that data indicated employees working in congregate settings were more at risk of getting the disease. But Mulholland believes the impact of not vaccinating grocery store employees across the state could be grim. We could expose a couple of hundred people. All of my employees could possibly do that to so many more people. That's why we need to be safe. And when we asked for clarification, the spokesperson with the Iowa Department of Public Health says agriculture, distribution and manufacturing sectors where social distancing is infeasible classify as congregate settings. In Des Moines, Kayla James, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. The president of the Iowa Grocery Industry Association says its workers are essential and they should get the vaccine. Michelle Hurd told us today her organization has been in contact with the governor's office and the Iowa Department of Public Health to stress the importance of giving grocery workers the vaccine. She says they understand the demand exceeds the, va the amount of vaccine right now and the industry is trying to be patient as the state works on the rollout.